Ahoy hoy, Captain Jesse Tattoo here, and today I bring you a Marauder's Chest and my sort of quick slideshow thing about how I made this. Um, the long and short of the story is, ever since I first started playing this game, I fell in love with the Marauder's Chest. I think it's an absolutely beautiful, most iconic chest of them all. Anyway, um, I used to make props. I used to make a lot of cosplay costumes and props. And I honestly knew I could make this. I just wanted to. Um, I was trying to make a frame, and then I found this wonderful um, wicker chest at a thrift store for like five bucks and it was so close and it was the right size and it was lightweight it was just too close to leave in the store for five bucks anyway i bought it obviously and uh i started working on it pretty much right away and uh well here you go i hope you enjoy the the little bit of a crafting montage that i've uh, created here for you guys today okay so i started off with a bunch of craft core foam core stuff and uh, yeah, just started hot gluing panels to the to the chest. And then I got some of that uh, foam floor mat. That's what that uh, green and blue stuff is. And I cut the core out of these chunks of the foam core so that I could bend it and get nice. Um, smooth corners for the edges as you can see here pardon my vertical photos I know I'm an amateur and uh, yeah they started uh, started shaping up pretty good now I looked everywhere I couldn't find those little diamond studs anywhere so I ended up using um, these rhinestone things which ended up fitting the bill pretty well I glued glued and glued coated more coats of glue like white glue, Mod Podge, whatever you want to call it. Lots of coats of that. It really helps fill in the gaps and even everything out and uh, helps, uh, helps a little bit with the sharp edges. Um, as you can see, I, uh, it's coming together really nice. Um, I really wanted to redo the handles though. The handles that were originally on it were garbage. And I found these handles on the top of uh, animal crate carrier things at a thrift store. So I bought two of them just for their handles. One of them was red, one of them was black. A little spray paint fixed it, but whatever. And I used some hooks to attach into the sides. And uh, yeah, that was pretty much it for the actual build part. Um, I spray painted it, coated it with some uh, primer, some car primer to really seal everything in. Sorry about the shaky camera. <laughs> Oh yeah, and then I, uh, I drilled chunks out of the corners and screwed in these uh, really powerful uh, earth magnets and then glued some tattoo springs, springs from tattoo machines. They were just metal I had lying around from my old days. Um, I glued those to the top so that the magnets would work. So uh, the, the lid closes by magnets. And I had to paint it black, paint it black. Um, because this brown wasn't sticking. The brown was too transparent. So I had to paint all the wood panels black first and then wood tone. And, uh, and then I got some chrome paint and did the rest. And man, ho, 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 I love this thing. I really do. I'm pretty proud of it, not going to lie. I think it turned out pretty good. It's, uh, the magnets hold really, really well. Yeah, there you go, folks. Hope you enjoyed. And if you did enjoy, don't forget to subscribe and like the video and share this all over social media so it can go viral and I can get paid because that's what we're here for, right? The booty. We're here for the gold. The gold. <laughs> ah, yeah, well, anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.